hey there, I just wanted to show you through Measure Twice Planners how to look at the platform, also how to open up the different modules, and also how to report the CE or the experience hours for the CFP. So once you go to measuretwicepanners.com, you'll click this icon here, which will become your own profile picture if you go into settings. But you'll go to My Library first. Then you'll choose Measure Twice Planners. At the very top, you'll see any announcements. So for example, we have our bi-weekly Thursday meetings at 3 p.m. Eastern noon Pacific time, where we review real case studies in real time live with other members. So I'd love for you to attend those if you can. You can actually register for those in this calendar just below that. So you can see next Thursday, you can register here, register here to attend. You'll receive an email from Zoom to be able to put those dates on your calendar. Moving down, you start with the Measure Twice Planners video course. This is a seven hour video course sharing my comprehensive financial planning process. As you go into these modules and the, into these lessons, you'll also notice that beyond the video that's in each lesson, on the right side, there's all the downloads. So any downloads, templates, tools, calculators that I mentioned in the video are here as well. Also any links that I sh are shared within the video are below the video. So going back, that is the seven hour video course. Um, you receive CE hours, so that's for CFP professionals. So as an example, in that video course, at the end of each module, let's say I'm on the end of current financial ecosystem, there's a CE quiz as its own lesson. So when you go into this quiz, you can see that you'll enter your first name, last name, CFP board ID, and then answer the remaining questions. Um, you'll need to get a 70% passing score to receive the CE hours for the given, the given lesson. After the Measure Twice Planners course, which was designed for financial advisors to really gain an understanding of a conference of financial planning process, we have the Measure Twice Money video course, which actually came out earlier this year in March, 2024. This video course was designed to help consumers, you know, non-advisors create their own financial plan as a family. So similar to the Measure Twice Planners course, you have all of your lessons, um, of course, these are updated with new visuals, new audio, new video. There are uh, 38 lessons in the Measure Twice Money course. Moving down past the video courses, this is really the newest edition. We have the Measure Twice Planners case studies and the forensics archives. So when we meet bi-weekly during our meetings, those meetings are recorded and they're published here in this module. So each month has its own module, for example, June 2024. Uh, we watched Jamie's second financial planning meeting and also analyzed her, her pay statement and her income analysis. So you'll see the lessons for those weeks. So we met on June 4th. So if you go in there, you can watch the recording or the video for that lesson. You can download any of the templates here. On the right side, you'll see the actual templates that we fill out. That'll be necessary to submit your homework, quote unquote, for the CFP experience hours. But going back into that module, when you go into the MTP case studies module, each month not only has its video lessons, but also has two quizzes. So there's a CFP experience quiz and a CE quiz. So on the path to becoming a CFP professional, the standard pathway experience hours are submitted by going to the experience quiz. And you'll start that. You'll enter your first name, last name, CFP board ID number, and then upload those two documents. So as you know, each, each lesson has its own documents that I'd like for you to fill out as your submission to you know, ensure that you did the work to receive your 50 hours of CE per month, sorry, of experience per month. So you upload those, submit that quiz. So that's the first part of reporting is submitting the experience hours to me so I can let the CFP board know that you did indeed receive and uh, achieve those 50 hours. The second part of reporting beyond reporting to me is actually reporting those same hours to the CFP board. So this, will, this can be done monthly or as you complete those hours. Um, going back into that module, you'll see at the very top of that module, the MTP case studies, that there's a lesson called CFP experience hours, 50 hours per month, reporting instructions. So you'll watch this quick video. It's about two, uh, two minutes long. Uh, most importantly, you'll see this link below. Click here for the experience reporting instructions. When you go to this landing page, these are the step-by-step -step visual instructions on how to report your CFP experience to the CFP board directly. So you'll go through this list, um, certainly um, sending any emails to me or the CFP board if you have any questions about you know, experience reporting in general or specific to Measure Twice Planners. 
once you've submitted your hours to me and the CFP board, that's all you have to do. Uh, I will email the CFP board once a month to submit the experience hours to them. In terms of the CE hours, uh, that's even easier. All you'll do is submit a CE quiz. Again, you'll, you'll fill out your first, last name, CFP board ID, and complete the quiz if you receive a 70% pass rate. Um, those will be submitted directly to the CFP board, and there's nothing you have to do. So you only have to report to the CFP board when you are looking for the experience hours, but not for the CE credit. Lastly, in Measure Twice Planners, we have um, some planning calculator tutorials. If you want to learn more about the inputs and outputs in each of my Excel calculators. And then lastly, member feedback and testimonials. There's a form here you can fill out if you'd like. Um, that really gives me a better idea of you know, what's provided value to you as a Measure Twice Planners member. And also, if you have any suggestions on you know, future value that you'd like to look, look you know, receive moving forward. Uh, also, public testimonials with no obligation if you enjoy Measure Twice Planners membership. So I hope this has helped. I, I'm excited for you to dig in to the membership and explore all the different member benefits. Thank you so much.